morning and just finished his brew probably, uh, I want to say like 20, 30 minutes ago and then I came in around one and started mine. So it's kind of like a simultaneous movement. So I mashed in while he was running off his beer into the tank so that when this was empty, my rest was finished and this tank could be like rinsed out and clean so that I could start my water, which I just did. Thanks next door are uh, 2,000 liters and our brew system here is 1,000 liters. So uh, to fill one of those tanks takes two days generally, but now that I'm like sufficiently good at brewing, Liam can come in the morning, I can come in the afternoon, and we can fill one of those tanks. And in the long run, that saved us about 10 days. Playing around with some new um, dishes. We were just in LA and went to a bunch of different restaurants. And probably the highlight I just was we went to Grand Central Market, which is like really cool. It's right downtown LA, and you just have all these like real, like authentic cuisines from all over around the world and uh, one of the dishes that we loved was a Filipino dish and it was with um, uh, pork and rice and what would you call those sauces just that they had on there? Uh, it's adobo, it's like vinegar, soy, chilies, garlic, uh, a lot of pickling, a lot of no mm -hmm. Yeah, it was one of, well, probably out of probably one of our top five mm -hmm. dishes that we had. It was simple but it was just thick. Yeah. Flavor. So we're gonna uh, we're gonna run that as a special tonight. And we're looking at tweaking our burger a little bit, and then we're also uh, looking at uh, running a, uh, a new making a went to a really rad spot where they um, a Thai restaurant, but they do kind of like a noodle, but it's almost like a Chinese noodle. They they did it was like really stringy. So we're gonna do that with a Thai fried chicken. So we're gonna run that as a special tomorrow night. So. Yeah.